what a hot day it is outside. Oh. This is nice. Hey guys, it's Max here, feeling a little hot this summer. In this week's video, I'll show you how to make a fan. A really simple fan from a few basic materials. So let's get started. Start out by poking a hole in your giant container lid. Is there even such a thing? Can we switch up all the rules? And imagine how you told me Glue both the weights together and then attach them to the container lid. Expectations take away me down. My heart is begging me to get the hell out of my head. This bottle cap is just for the stability of the rod. Glue the rod in place and then attach a bigger bottle cap on the top. Now let's make a place for the motor to sit on. Hey guys, just if you haven't yet, make sure you subscribe and turn on that notification bell not to miss my new videos. Okay, let's get back to the video. Then let's push these wires through the copper pipe. Now let's glue the motor on and connect it up. Let's integrate the switch. Now let's connect the switch to one of the wires in the pair. Let's tie this copper wire onto the motor just for extra strength. Now for the propeller, since we want the most wind coming out of it, don't face it this way, but turn it around and attach it on that way so that more wind will be pushed. Attach a shiny hex nut for decoration if you want. Once you've connected up the phone charger, let's test the table fan out. Okay everyone, that's all for this week's video. Don't forget to give it a like, share with your friends, and subscribe if you're new. Just a little quick tip, if you have a little motor like mine which can't handle too much voltage, don't keep it on for longer than 20 or to 30 minutes because it may burn out. You'll probably smell it, so yeah. Thanks for watching guys. See you next time. Peace!